Over the course of several months, students in the Champlain College Sandbox team worked with new technology to create two digital art installations at the Burlington International Airport. People drive by Champlain College, say it's a beautiful campus, but no one's really sure what's going on behind those walls. And Gene walked through and said, we need to replicate what's going on behind these walls at the airport. The first one, flight, allows anyone to become an airplane soaring through the sky. They even get to choose which type of aircraft they want to be, and it's already causing a big buzz. When I came and visited the airport last week, I was told about this one elderly woman who actually had a member of the airport staff hold her cane for her so she could try it out. Um, so it's little things like that that, as a developer of the game, really make it all worth it. The second lets people become artists using their hands to choose colors to paint on a 70-inch television screen. It's designed to be interactive, to engage people in a very natural way, and we believe that it embodies much of the education, the radically pragmatic education, that takes place at Champlain College. Students say the work they've done in this out-of-classroom team has really enhanced what's being taught day to day. As a junior in college, I'm working with skeletal tracking, I'm working with virtual reality, I'm working on stuff that people in my industry wish they could be working on, and I'm doing it as a college student. In Burlington, Jennifer Sheehan, NBC5 News. Well, big isn't always better. 